Post-operative neurobehavioral disturbance is a term which is not commonly used in the medical literature, but is a term that was used by a coroner to describe the circumstances that may have contributed to uh, the death of a patient that we're uh, aware of. Uh, it's a triad of three separate conditions uh, as described by Dr. Sanders in Anesthesiology, I think, last year, uh, which is made up of post-operative cognitive dysfunction, which we know quite a lot about, um, emergence delirium, which is a common phenomenon that really reflects the same sort of circumstances you might encounter following an excessive alcohol intake, and the last and most significant in terms of its catastrophic effect is uh, post-operative psychosis. And those, that triad makes up the broad term post-operative neurobehavioral disturbance. There are other things which can have similar symptoms, but um, they have known causes like, for example, if you take dexamethasone, you can have a psychotic reaction to that. So this is those conditions that cannot be accounted for by other um, uh, descriptions. Interestingly, there isn't in any of the compendiums that generally describe um, men mental illness a separate descriptor for this particular event. It's something which we're really just beginning to understand r very recently. Um, and so it hasn't featured in, in, as one of the uh, definable conditions in those compendiums.